Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Carter, and for those of you who don't know me, I make beauty, lifestyle, and DIY videos. One really important aspect of beauty to me is what is commonly referred to as inner beauty, which for me, I think of it more as mental health. So our mental health is very important because it has a lot to do with who we are on a daily basis and how we react and and the things that we, you know, believe about ourselves and all this kind of stuff. And so today I wanted to share the best thing that I have ever done for my mental health. And it's my gratitude journal. I have to say I'm absolutely in love with this guy. I cannot express to you the positive feelings that I have about this notebook. The love is so extremely intense because of what has gone into it and how it has affected my life. I've been writing in a gratitude journal for about a year and I first heard about a gratitude journal from Abraham and Esther Hicks. They are just basically teachers of the law of attraction. The law of attraction makes tons of sense to me and I welcome that into my life which is why I started my gratitude journal. And here I just write about all of the positive things that I can think of. I just make huge lists of everything that I'm grateful for. And sometimes I do categories, like I'll do YouTube as a category and I'll list all the things that I'm so happy about that are happening with YouTube. So, you know, whether you your category is your job, your relationships, your friend, a specific friend or family member, yourself, which I absolutely highly, highly recommend. When you write in your gratitude journal, write positive things about you. That is what it has helped me with the most, is my relationship with myself, how I feel about myself, the thoughts that I think about myself. By just writing the positive things that are happening in my life, my entire world has changed. I am more apt to be aware of all of the good that is going on around me. So I don't know if you've heard of the law of attraction, but basically what you put out is what you get back. So whatever energy you're offering is what you're going to get back. So if you're sitting there saying, I'm so grateful for this, I'm so glad I have, you know, X, Y, or Z, the more that you focus on them, the more that, that you, they're going to come back into your life. One really easy way to describe this is like, you know how when there's something new you want to learn. So say you really want to learn how to ride a bike. Anytime you get free time, you get out there and you start riding that bike. With time, the more that you focus on riding the bike, the better that you're going to be at riding the bike. It's almost like practice makes perfect. When we focus in on something, it's gonna get bigger and bigger and better. So if we just sit there, you know, for five to 15 minutes a day, or, you know, you can set up your own schedule that works well for your life with your gratitude. If we just sit Sit there and we're like, I am going to focus on every little positive aspect of my life. I'm going to, even if I only have $5, I'm going to be grateful for my $5. Or even if I only have one friend, I am so grateful for that one friend. If we repeatedly do that and we just keep saying like, oh, I'm so grateful for this. I'm so grateful for this. And we just hone in and we focus on our gratitude. Then those things that we're grateful for, other they're just going to grow and grow and grow. And what I've gotten from it is just pure positivity. I started focusing on my gratitude, so then I started noticing more things in my life that were going right, and then I started being grateful for those things. The more that I do that, the more positivity just seeps all throughout my life experience. I've even noticed that when I don't write in my gratitude as often as I'd like, that my brain is just still a really positive place and it's the coolest thing ever. I can't emphasize enough how fabulous it has been for me and my brain and my mental health to focus on what is going right. I will tell you one more rule that I have for this. Nothing bad is allowed in here. This journal is strictly for everything that is going right in my life. It is the only thing that I am allowed to write in here. It is all positive. Every little thing in here is just a blessing. Focusing on them helps my blessings grow, not just on paper, but in my brain. I'm so much happier on a daily basis. I'm better at coping. I'm better at seeing the silver linings. And I'm better at accepting the fact that the things that feel bad in my life are here to lift me to greater places, to better versions of myself. That's my quick tip for you guys. Open up a journal and just start writing all about the wonderful things about yourself, about your friends, about your life, about your family, 
about your belongings, anything that makes you happy. There's nothing too big or too small to write about. And I promise it will seep into other areas of your life and positivity will follow you everywhere you go. It will be a wonderful experience and your brain and your body will just be full of joy. Thank you guys so much for watching today. Make sure that you leave a comment letting me know what you do to stay happy on a daily basis and also share that with my other viewers so that we can all be a really strong, powerful group of happy people who are enjoying their lives. If you enjoy my content, please do subscribe. And if you enjoyed this video, I would really appreciate if you gave it a thumbs up. It is so very helpful. That's all I have to say to you guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I'm really grateful for your presence here. I will see you very soon. And until then, I wish you enough. Bye. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Carter and today I'm going to be doing a calligraphy Q&A. So some of these questions have been asked repeatedly and then some of them have just been asked